and a very pleasant welcome to News Watch. And uh, as we uh, stroll through this uh, beautiful Tuesday, uh, rain about, and uh, we're going to check that out. And uh, also get you some updates on things going on in and about the town. Now, uh, here is uh, one definite uh, type uh, issue that we have. Uh, the, the road work yesterday on Mill Street did end early. We'll tell you more about that. And um, we'll get to some weather, some expanded hours for a group that really needed it. And uh, sports, of course, with Alex. And uh, there was a test this week to see Alex come in and do some stuff. And uh, we're going to try and expand upon that. And just a few other things as we breeze through this uh, great Tuesday. So uh, make sure that uh, you get and stay tuned because the train is on the tracks and news watch is straight ahead. Broadcasting from the greatest castle in the world in the county of Lawrence, NC TV 45. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. If you're craving hot dogs and more, and you're in the area, then look no farther than Coney Island, downtown Newcastle on Kennedy Square. Bake Shop will make you happy. Owner Bill Cast and his staff keep the tradition going with all the bakery items you remember as a kid. Just to name a few, Bill makes cream sticks, cinnamon rolls, bear claws, cream horns, cannoli, cakes, pies, cookies, bread, pizza, and more. You can also buy homemade cup Italian ravioli. Bill's Bake Shop, located 228 North Liberty Street in the Mahoningtown section of Newcastle, is open Tuesday through Saturday, 7 to 5, and Sunday, 7 to 2, closed Monday. Bills, where smiles are everywhere. Call 724-654-4223. Well, as uh, we get to News Watch for this Tuesday, the 25th, let me wish you a happy uh, Mardi Gras. And uh, let's take a look for this fat Tuesday at the weather outside. 40 degrees, kind of a misty rain. It picks up and goes away. Uh, so uh, here's, uh, we're going to get precipitation over the next few days. Here's Cleveland radar. And uh, you can see as uh, we get a little bit there, uh, there's rain throughout Ohio, and uh, here's the berg. So, uh, but we'll uh, keep you posted. There's rain throughout southeastern Ohio, and uh, 
that gives you an idea. Now, uh, let's get to the top stories today in Newcastle, PA. This is in from Mercer County. Right there is Jim McKeskey, longtime executive director of the Mercer County United Way. He announced his retirement effective May 1st, 2020 at the February meeting of the Mercer County United Way Board. Uh, okay, and he held his post. Uh, he held held this past Wednesday. Longtime executive director announced his pending retirement. It was with deep regret that the board reluctantly accepted Jim's letter and stated Board Chairman William Gathers, retired Mercer County Area School Superintendent. Uh, so. Uh, we wish Jim well as uh, <coughs> he moves on. And I had just mentioned this yesterday, and Chris Sonata brought it up. Uh, the PennDOT DMV out there in Union, uh, they will extend their hours and they'll operate Tuesday through Saturday. 8.30 to 4.15. The reason being is when you go out there, you're going to be standing in some long lines. And I do mean long because uh, it's it's been that type of uh, all uh, turmoil out there for people getting uh, their license. Now, Mardi Gras, Fat, <coughs> excuse me, Fat Tuesday. I didn't know this was called Shrove Tuesday, but it, it is. And something that came to light was about the pancakes being made on Tuesday before uh, Ash Wednesday. Apparently, in older times, they weren't allowed to even have dairy products. There's a free pancake breakfast supper Tuesday the 25th 4.30 to 6 right here at Trinity Episcopal Church North Mill Street across from Dunkin Donuts. So uh, make sure you get out for that. Also keep in mind that there from 4 to 7 Good Lutheran, Good Shepherd Lutheran Church, 2323 Old Butler Road, is also having a pancake uh, dinner from 4 to 7. And also St. John's Lutheran, free to the public, 2601 Highland Avenue. For more information, call 724-674-7491. And uh, that kind of gets you through uh, the idea of uh, who's having what this uh, this uh, Strove Tuesday or Mardi Gras, however you uh, want to put it. Now, uh, let's go to sports and uh, basketball for colleges winding down and getting the tournament time and uh, also the Canes in action Wednesday here you go Orlando 115 Brooklyn 113 in baseball you had Houston 11-1 over Detroit you had the Mets 2-1 over Washington and you had the Chicago White Sox and the Dodgers tied 2-2 the Indians lost to the Rockies, and the Pirates tied the Yankees 3-3. So, uh, with that, let's get to the Cedar Sports Quarter. We'll be right back. The Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. 
They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle, 724-658-9543. That's 724-658-9543. Welcome everybody to the Cedar Sports Corner. Tonight's games in college basketball. We have Dayton traveling to George Mason, Duke traveling to Wake Forest, DePaul traveling to Xavier, Toledo traveling to take on Central Michigan, Buffalo traveling to Ohio to take on the Bobcats, North Carolina State going up against the North Carolina Tar Heels in Chapel Hill and San Jose State traveling to Utah State to finish off the night. In hockey, NHL hockey, we have the Calgary Flames traveling to take on the Boston Bruins, the Vancouver Canucks traveling to Montreal to take on the Canadians, the Toronto Maple Leafs traveling to take on the Tampa Bay Lightning, the New York Rangers traveling to take on, well, not so much traveling, but taking on the New York Islanders. San, ha San Jose traveling to Philadelphia. Winnipeg Jets going up to take on the hated Washington Capitals and Alex Ovechkin. The Dallas Stars traveling to, take, traveling to Carolina to take on the Hurricanes. The New Jersey Devils traveling to Detroit to take on the Red Wings. Chicago traveling to St. Louis. Ottawa traveling to Nashville, Columbus traveling to Minnesota, the Florida Panthers traveling to Arizona to take on the Coyotes, and the Edmonton Oilers traveling to Anaheim to take on the Mighty Ducks. In NBA basketball, we have the Charlotte Hornets traveling to Indiana to take on the Pacers, the Milwaukee Bucks traveling to take on the Toronto, the Toronto Raptors. Steven Adams and Oklahoma City traveling to Chicago to take on the Bulls. Detroit traveling to Denver to take on the Nuggets. The Boston Celtics traveling to Portland to take on the Trailblazers. The New Orleans Pelicans traveling to Los Angeles to take on the LeBron Lakers as I like to call them. And the Sacramento Kings traveling to take on the Golden State Warriors. This has been the Cedar Sports Corner and let's take a break everyone. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Penn, Ohio Bottled Water Company, home residential, commercial, water coolers. You can contact us Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 p.m. We're fast, efficient, and we deliver water. We offer 100% customer satisfaction guarantee. Contact us today at 724-498-4760. This program brought to you by Cummings Landscaping and Design. Random Cummings, lower operator.
Well, we're back, and uh, as we were showing you before, here's that look at weather. And uh, Cleveland, you're seeing the rain that uh, moved through and some of the rain that's on the way. And uh, your Pittsburgh, kind of the same thing as uh, we're clear to Pittsburgh right now. Temperature outside. If you were so wondering, 40 degrees and uh, Rotary 89, and I was there yesterday, uh, great friends of Rotary, I enjoy their company. Uh, Rotary Clubs District uh, 7280 will host their Rotary Youth Leadership Conference June 7th to the 12th, Westminster College eligible candidates include any young men or women regardless of race, creed, color, uh, and will be high school seniors in September. And this will demonstrate leadership uh, uh, potential in school, church, community service. They should also have a desire to develop leadership potential and contribute to making the conference meaningful experience. Okay, uh, Erodia 89 will sponsor students from Newcastle, Union, Laurel, Shenango, Nishanik, and more. So, uh, hats off to that group. And, uh, meanwhile, back in the Scottish Rite Cathedral, Getting ready for a steak fry on a day like this. We're, we're going to get pounded with some precipitation and then snow. But Thursday the 13th. So there, uh, go up, sign up now. It'll put you in a warm mood. <coughs> this happening. Okay. <coughs> At Pokeberry. Caracas stones, and I got them. Okay, Tuesday the 24th. Space is limited. There's a $15 entrance fee. You got a call. But just so you know, just so you know, uh, it's really a neat little thing. So uh, I think it's something you should try and uh, definitely take a look at those Caracas stones or, or something. Now, um, I'm going to take, and the reason I'm going through here, and um, I apologize for that, is um, a couple different things. Number one, today Mardi Gras, tomorrow Ash Wednesday, and um, you're going to want to know where to get ashes. Well, all denominations at the YMCA, they're giving ashes. Uh, and I believe it was 7 to 11. Uh, so, uh, 9 to 11. All denominations, 9 to 11, 15. Now, with respect to Holy Spirit Parish, and here you go, this is the Ash Wednesday schedule. St. Joseph, 7, 8.30, St. Vitus, 10 o'clock, St. Vincent de Paul, noon, St. Mary's, 4 o'clock, St. Anthony's, 6 o'clock, St. James, 7 o'clock, St. Camillus, 7 o'clock, St. Vitus. So, uh, you got a good idea of what's going on there for Ashes. We're broadcasting and coming at you from the beautiful Majestic. Stop down, see the great apartments they have. They start at 575. New appliances, new carpet. Yeah, you got to check out the Majestic. Now, uh, let's go to weather. Okay. Here is your Cleveland radar. South and west of us looks kind of ominous. 
And uh, that being said, here's the Pittsburgh radar, and uh, you can tell south and east of us, they've had something coming through also. So, with that, what are your current conditions? 93% humidity, winds from the northeast to 5, barometric pressure 29.77, dew point 38, and visibility, why that's 6 miles. And uh, we're going to get to Lawrence County 45 weather, and uh, just kind of give you that uh, idea what you're dealing with. Folks, this is going to be one of those weeks where uh, you're going to get a lot of precipitation. It's going to be chilly. Like right now, we have a wind chill factor of 36. Okay. So, uh, buckle up. Here comes March, and uh, here comes NCTV 45 weather. BSP. Big Shot Bobs are the wings for me. 50 flavors make it right you see. BSB has sandwiches you have to try. Stop in and you'll know why. Every day of the week you see. Call or stop in to BSB. Big Shot Bobs will be your favorite place. Just like me. Easy clean car and van wash. Where your clean wash is our goal. Hello and a very pleasant welcome to Lawrence County 45 weather and uh, well the good weather has passed us it's time for a little of the inclement variety last night 38 and rain and uh, that's going to be the flavor of the day as uh, local radar not showing up, but the national scene, there you go, out to the south and west, there's the precip. And uh, in just in case the wind wants to come from the north and west, we got it up there too. So, uh, pretty special, and uh, here you go. Last night, 38 and rain. Today, rain, 48. Chance of rain, 90%. Wednesday, well, as you get to Tuesday night, cloudy, 41. Chance of rain, 40%. Wednesday, chance of rain, 90%. With I have 48. Wednesday night, Overnight low of 24, 70% chance of precipitation, it changes to snow. Thursday brings on the snow. Cloudy, 30, 60% chance of snow. Thursday night, cloudy, low 18, 40% chance of snow. Friday, 40% chance of snow, 28. Friday night, cloudy, low of 17, 30% chance of snow. So you got a cuddle alert going basically from Wednesday night, not real, real bad, but Thursday and Friday night, definitely a cuddle alert. And that will continue on Saturday. Cloudy, 27. Saturday night, mostly cloudy, 17. And Sunday, Cloudy with a high of 32. 
So, uh, hang in there, folks, as uh, Sunday's the first day of March. Okay, but uh, February doesn't want to let go of its icy grip. And we haven't had so much icy grips, but I don't want to have it in March. <laughs> so that was BSB's NCTV 45 weather. Special thanks to Easy Clean Car and Man Wash and Tuscany Square, both up there in the Shannon. Go up, get your car cleaned, and have a great deal. Mill, how's that? We're going to take this break, and when we get back, a whole lot more after uh, we hear from Tuscany Square. And uh, this was <coughs> Lawrence County 45 weather, so we'd like to hear from you. Hey, we're back, and uh, just like that, Saturday the 29th, it's comedy night down at the Confluence. Yes, uh, they're having a special uh, thing there. It's adults only. Uh, make sure you check out the Confluence. Also, Saturday night, February 29th, 8 to 11, Comedy Night at Town and Country. Uh, Bar and Grill, Nikki Stewart, Marcus Martin, Tom Wolf, Hopkins Malcolm, Floyd, John, uh, and Don will be your hosts. So uh, make sure that uh, you get on over to Town and Country. And they are a proud sponsor of NCTV 45. We're going to be back with a wrap-up right after these messages. There's more than me behind I've got a gift of a new castle I tried There's a small town forever Look around Special thanks going out to Town Mall Pizza for sponsorship of this program. Located in the Cascade Galleria, Newcastle. At our law firm, we see you. Come see us at lgkg.com. These fine businesses provided funding for this program. Gatherings, Town and Country, and On Target. Hello, well, that's going to do it for us here at NCTV45's Morning News Watch. Hopefully you're going to get out and about today and uh, have a great day. Uh... It being Fat Tuesday, make sure that uh, you get ready and know that uh, tomorrow we break into Lent. And uh, with that, uh, if you're getting up, moving around, today's song of the day, morning. So, uh, and yes, it is morning. Make sure you tell a friend about NCTV45. They'll be glad you did. When they say, oh, I don't watch a lot of TV. You tell them NCTV45 is available anytime on your time. 
Yes, a train that runs on your schedule, that's at CTV45. Make sure that you get that second cup of coffee as I straighten my microphone. And have a super day in what I call the greatest castle of the world in the county of Lawrence. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you again real soon.